everyone, Daisy here again with another Leo for Spiegel Mom Scraps. This weekend um, we are having a crafty collaboration with Bramble Fox. Bramble Fox creates these amazing acrylic pieces and so we were sent some of their acrylic pieces to use and they were sent some awesome sequins to use and so the design teams have teamed up to form the dream team and we are to create layouts using the products we were given. So I'm starting out with this um, free cut file that I got from Paper Issues and it is a bunch of different pie charts and I'm using these papers that are from the Stay Colorful collection by Dear Lizzie and just backing the largest one. Now I cut out multiple of these um, different sizes and I just used my Silhouette Design Studio to kind of alter the sizes of them. The colors of the papers were a little bit brighter than I wanted so I did first put a piece of vellum over them um, or on the back of the cut file and then put the actual pieces of paper underneath. And now I am backing a few of these um, pie chart pieces with some vellum. I kind of wanted this to be more white on white but then have that middle pop of color. I just didn't want it to be too bright because my picture isn't very bright. Um, it's a picture of my daughter's birthday pie. Um, if you've been watching my channel, you know that my daughter Claire prefers birthday pie to birthday cake. And so this was for her 10th birthday and it was a picture of the pie with the candles lit and it was in the dark. So um, I guess I didn't want like all the bright colors to kind of pull away from the photo. So now what I'm doing is I am backing a few of these on some, it's a scrapbook layout um, or a page protector, that's what I'm thinking of here. And because I'm going to turn them into shaker pockets so it's kind of my clear layer and I'm just cutting them out. You can see up in the corner there, um, sorry about the glare on there, but there is a package that has the word celebrate and hashtag awesome and they are in this beautiful yellow color and I am going to use the celebrate on this layout. And then I'm also using two sequin mixes for this and of course I put them away so let me pull them out real quick. I'm going to be using Pick Your Plum, which is one of the newer releases, and then I'm also using um, Glitter Love, which was also a recent release, um, just not part of the newest one. Sorry for all the noise. So now I'm just backing, um, I'm going to use Fun Foam and create the kind of dimension for my shaker pockets and for the two of the pie charts that are a little bit larger I'm going to use um, some fun foam on each of the little spokes of the pie chart and that is just so that all of the sequins don't just kind of settle at the bottom I want them to be in each of the spaces and then I'm going to fill so I have four shaker pockets on the layout and I'm going to fill two of them with the Glitter Love and two of them with the Pick Your Plum. And from the Pick Your Plum, I'm using the more muted tones. There's some large um, sequins that are kind of white with like a pearlescent shimmer. And then some clear pink and some white ones. And those are the ones I use out of there. And then out of the Glitter Love, I use everything except for the pink hearts. And again, I, I don't want them to like super stand out, but you can still definitely see that they're there. And I'm not going to make you watch me do all of this. I'm almost finished. I'm just going to do one more. This is another one of the big pie charts, so I'm going to fill in the, the little spokes with some fun foam. 
and here you can see I'm going to be picking out, picking and choosing which um, sequins I want to put in the shaker pocket. And then I'm just backing these with some white cardstock because it is going on white cardstock. I figured that would be a perfect way to kind of back these shakers. And then through the magic of YouTube, I will magically come back and they will be finished. And then I will start embellishing. So for the Dream Team Hop, we are doing, um, it's actually an Instagram hop. So you, in order to be entered to win, each shop is giving away a $20 gift card. In order to be entered to win, you need to go to Instagram. You have to follow both Bramble Fox and Spiegel Mom Scraps, and you need to leave a comment on one of the posts um, for one of the days. Bramble Fox is also giving you an additional opportunity to win um, by joining their Facebook group and leaving a comment there. And then both shops are having a 15% off sale, so you can use the code DREAM15 to get 15% off of your next purchase. So if you haven't already checked it out, you definitely want to do that before time runs out. The um, gift cards are going to be drawn today, so September 2nd, Sunday, September 2nd. Um, it'll be later on this evening. Um, so you definitely don't want to miss out on that. So now I'm working on my title and celebrate is the first word and it's going to be celebrate with a piece of birthday pie. And so I'm using a mix of these little thickers and the rose gold are the perfect color to go with this layout. And then I'm going to go find some glittery thickers to go or for the word pie. But the celebrate just makes the perfect addition to this page. Um, it brings in another color, one of the colors from that um, pattern paper that I have behind my photo. And then I'm going to add um, another little bit of yellow so that there's three kind of areas of yellow. Actually, I guess it ends up being four because I forgot about that pattern paper. But anyhow, I love the way this comes out. I really love doing white on white kind of layouts. So if you haven't already, like I said, head on over to Instagram. You want to be sure to follow both of them and leave comments. And also, um, if you are shopping and it's after the sale is done, you can use my code DAISY15 for 15% off and that's any time in the shop. So you don't want to miss out on that. And then this is pretty much going to be the end of my layout. So I want to thank you so much for watching, and I will see you again next time. Bye!